Hey everyone, this is Vanessa DeBerlay and welcome to my channel. Did you ever open up your YouTube channel, your channel page, just to find out that your subscribers went way down? Every day you check and you can see them gradually going up and then all of a sudden they just plummet. What causes that? That's what we're going to talk about today. And as you can see, I had this experience this week. And after you're finished crying and getting upset, let me explain to you what's going on. Actually, it's a good thing. YouTube will occasionally go back through all the records and look for legitimate subscribers. There are a lot of spams out there, just like on your telephone, not legitimate calls. Well, it happens in YouTube as well. And the company comes in and will find those fake subscribers or fake accounts and just delete them. So how do they end up on your account? It's like right here, I have over 600. How did they get there? I have to confess that when I first started my channel and I was still new, just like you, trying to figure out how to do everything, I was taking advice from all kinds of different people and one particular person I was following, I won't give their name because I still like them for other things, but they suggested purchasing your subscribers so that you could get monetized. And while that might be good to get monetized, it does, it's not good for long-term effects. As you can see, they will be found and they will be deleted. So I'm assuming that most of that is from two years ago when I did do that. I bought actually a thousand. So there they are and um, they should be all coming out and everything will be organic. Don't do that. Um, when you're first starting, you really get anxious and you want to get those thousand subscribers and you want to get those views. But if you don't let it happen organically, then something like this is going to happen and it really messes up the analytics of your channel. I have another channel that I have totally done organic and I did it on purpose because I wanted to show uh, myself how one can uh, a channel can do when it's growing on its own as compared to when you're trying to manipulate. Um, let me go ahead and pull that up for you right now. This here is my channel called My Amish Neighbor, and I really do have a passion for this one as far as it, it's a hobby. I love where I live, I'm out in the country amongst Amish neighbors, and I do love driving around, um, meeting with different people, interviewing them, and, and just um, learning from their lifestyle. Um, especially where we're going in our world right now, um, I can learn a lot from them. But I want you to see my views. I've done nothing to this channel. I actually don't even post them to another social media account. I make them, I put them on here and I move on and I interact. And this one has been 100% organic, but you can see, you know, some of the different videos um, are less than a hundred, but I, but almost all of them are three and four digit. Okay. So this is a new channel. It's less than a year old. It's already monetized. Um, one, one particular video took off really well. I don't know if it's going to show up on this one page but it has over 212, there it is, this one here. That one took off really well and that's when I got monetized. So that happened back in July. And you know, other videos, you can see where they're all over the place. And that's typical on a channel. But my point to you is, if you are providing a video on a topic that people are looking for, then it's going to be found and it's going to be watched. It's really that simple. I know that um, you're probably going crazy watching lots of different videos of how to look at the analytics and, and it, it gets crazy. And then they want to sell you all these software tools that are going to help you do it when really you just need to make good videos and be passionate about what you're doing, enjoy what you're doing and provide something that people are looking for. It's that simple. So don't go out and buy anything. Just be you. Tell us what you know. And we'll look you up and we'll watch it. It's and, and that'll help your channel grow. It's really the views that are more important than the subscribers. So I'm not really worried about the subscribers dropping. Because like I said, it helps clean all of that out. And hopefully that's done. And then we'll move on from there. But if your subscribers are falling dramatically, it's probably from that. Now, some of the spam subscribers could be spam accounts. Um, sometimes they come in, like I said, just like on your phone. But in my situation, I messed up in the beginning, did something I shouldn't have done. But again, I was advised to do it. Take it from me. Learned a lesson. Move on. Don't do it. All right. I hope that helps if you lost some of your subscribers. Um, that's pretty much what's going on. Don't fret. Just move on and keep providing those good videos. And I hope you have a blessed day. And thank you for watching. And I'll see you on the next video. 